Welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today is Saturday, March 26th, 2022, and the Lord's Word says, Be positioned for success. 1 Corinthians 15 57 reads, But thanks be to God who gives us the victory, making us conquerors through our Lord Jesus Christ. It is said that the future belongs to those who prepare for it. Be that as it may, Pastor explains that you, the Christian, are in a place of advantage because your future is already determined in Christ Jesus and it is a victorious one. You must only be positioned and prepared to enjoy it. Let's look at salvation for instance. Jesus Christ died for the whole world and the blessing of salvation has been made available to everyone in the world. God wants everyone to be saved but sadly, there are people who will still go to hell. Is it God's fault? Or was the salvation inadequate? Certainly not. It's because they chose not to accept his salvation. In the same manner, your victory and success in life has been foreordained in Christ Jesus. 2 Peter 1 verse 3 to 4 says, For his divine power has bestowed upon us all things that are requisite and suited to life and godliness through the full personal knowledge of him who called us by and to his own glory and excellence. By means of these, he has bestowed on us his precious and exceedingly great promises, so that through them you may escape by flight from the moral decay that is the rottenness and corruption that is in this world because of covetousness, and become sharers of the divine nature. Paul told Timothy this as written in 1 Timothy 1.18, that this charge I commit unto thee, son Timothy, according to the prophecies which went before on thee, that thou by them mightest war a good warfare. If you consistently practice the principles of success according to God's word, you are guaranteed to experience good success in every area of your life. On the other hand, the one who lives without purpose and a sense of direction will fail miserably in life. It's still early in the year, a favorable time to prepare and strategize by the Spirit to win and be a victor all through. It's not enough to hope for success. You make it happen. The choice is yours and you have made the right one as a child of God. Make this confession with me. Say thank you Lord Holy Spirit for guiding me in the path of success and leading me in the way of victory. I am wise and prepared for perpetual victories all through this year and beyond. I keep and do your word, which is my key for abundant fruition. Amen. As your reflection today, know that success and failure are neither by chance nor mysterious. Plan your victories as you go through every season of your life and meditate on Joshua 1.8 and Ephesians 2 verse 10. With Herald of Glory devotional, Every day is a perfect day. Pastor Julius Glorified Christ Lord, heralding the Glorious Church.